Hey everybody, new one Keelik here, and welcome to this guide on how to set up uh, Wind Waker Chaos Edition. Now, a lot of people have been asking me about this, and I noticed there wasn't a lot of information other than um, the link that I will go ahead and show you, but it's a lot easier to note something in a video form. So, first off, you're going to need Dolphin, okay? That's pretty obvious. Um, I'm using 5.0, works pretty well for me. Second, you're going to need the European version of this ROM. Let's go ahead and take a look at info. You're looking for this game ID. You need the PAL version of the Wind Waker ROM. I don't remember where I got mine, but wherever you're getting your ROMs, go to a trusted site, be sure you're getting the European slash PAL version. Should work out great for you. Second, we will need to get the code. Uh, I have this, should be down in the description. If not, you're welcome to copy this. Go ahead and hit enter there. Uh, you, you can also go to Cosmo Courtney's uh, YouTube page and achieve the same result. If this is irrelevant, don't worry about this. Just wait for this timer up here. Uh, you're not actually downloading anything. These are just files. So here is the readme file, which will give you a rough idea of what you're supposed to do, but it's kind of confusing. Um, I just managed to luckily get it. And here is the code. This is the absolute important part. So what you're going to want to do, copy all this. Bam. I've already done all this, but anyway, you copy this, take it over to Dolphin, Right click on, left click, no, right click on your game, yeah. Properties, um, gecko codes. And this is where it gets confusing. You know, you, where, where am I supposed to put this code in? Go to edit config. And all the way down here at the bottom, as you see, I have mine put in. Right under throw more than three bombs at once. Uh, useful code, but now what we're looking for. And just slap that code right in there. Exit out. Close this and. You might have to open it back up again, I'm not sure, I don't remember for sure. Anyway, you're going to want to take this on, and you should be good to go. Oh, one more thing that I forgot. Oh, it's under configuration. You need enable cheats enabled, obviously, we're going to be using cheats. Um, and enable GPU clock override at roughly 150%. Um, this will just help the mod run, I suppose. I had it higher before and it didn't really seem to cause too many problems. But I feel like that's probably where most people are going wrong is this area right here. So, go ahead and boot the game up. You'll see that it should work just fine. And plan it just fine. It is booted up and this is the ROM that I'm doing the series on and everything. So, anyway, I just wanted to make this quick tutorial. Thank you so much for watching all the way to the end. I hope this helped you out a little bit. Be feel free to check out uh, my Wind Waker Chaos Edition uh, walkthrough, let's play, whatever you want to call it. Feel free to check it out. It's been a pretty good time so far. Anyway, I'm Newborn Keelik, and I'll see you in the next one.